Yo, what up guys? Welcome back to Sneaker Stories as always. I'm your host, Chris Jack. Today, an incredibly exciting one, checking out the brand new Blazer Mid 77s in collaboration with Nike and Denim, of course. And not only that, announcing an exclusive giveaway whereby one of you guys will be able to win yourself a pair of these incredible shoes with Denim South Africa. So stick around till the end of the review to find out all the details you need to know to get yourself in a pair of these right here in South Africa. But without further ado, let's get to it. All right, so some of you guys who have been around sneaker stories for a while would have seen my review of the Air Max denim ones that I have over here. It was probably around a year or so ago where Denim South Africa released these. It gave all of us here in South Africa an actual chance of getting our hands on a pair of these shoes because they didn't really release anywhere else other than Nike sneakers and we didn't really have too much luck with that. And it was the exact same thing with the denim blazers, although the denim blazers never released anywhere locally here. So before I get into the shoes themselves, just a little bit about denim itself. Originally founded in 2008 in Amsterdam by English jean maker Jason Denim. The whole ethos behind this brand really combines the best of the East and the best of the West together. So really honoring tradition, sourcing fabrics from only the best mills across Italy and Japan, and providing contemporary cuts, insane comfort, and technological innovation design within its products. And obviously when it comes to shoes and their collaborations with Nike and they've done a handful of them right now. The Air Max ones were definitely an absolute firm favorite for me. I knew I had to get this pair. I couldn't get them locally so I went and paid resale for them and I don't regret that at all because the whole sort of like quality that Denim brings to the table is really instilled in their particular collaborations along with Nike. So what you're getting here even if it was at an increased price point is just arguably one of the best quality Air Max ones that I've seen here and on the blazer it is arguably even better. Now when it comes to the blazer itself, as I mentioned, the quality of materials used here are really just a cut above the rest. Like I haven't seen a leather quality on a shoe like this probably ever. Like it, this is this is really just something special. You really have to just experience this in hand to really understand what I'm talking about. It's kind of how I imagine these shoes to be produced way back in the 70s when the production ones were really, really small and the premium material that were being used back then was really what you got. A kind of a handmade construction, something that was really going to stand the test of time. And that in essence really is just the blazer silhouette. It's a clean cut silhouette. It's absolutely beautiful. You can wear them with just about absolutely anything. So to see that kind of quality back on the blazer in this current day and age is just mind-blowing. But further to that, denim brings its Japanese authenticity with its indigo kimono fabrics uh, used throughout the blazers, and we'll get into the details of this now, but it really just completely stands out uh, against this beautiful white, gray, and sail coloring of the rest of the outfit. But starting with the outsole of the shoe, this is where that sail color really comes in. It's a traditional blazer outsole with a bit of herringbone pattern, which runs through the bottom of the shoe. And flipping up into the midsole, they've kept this completely tonal white with the rubberized overlays here, and then stepping just above that, hits of this beautiful suede and kind of like a long hair suede used in the toe box and just the uh, side panel trimmings over there but obviously what really steals the show over here has to be the swooshes where they've used that kimono indigo fabric and each one of these denim pairs is completely unique because all of these materials are cut and sewn perfectly for the shoe and there are some differences in between the different swooshes that you get. So on the lateral side of the shoe, you've got this kimono indigo fabric over here with a bit of a sort of cross pattern on it. And then on the medial side of this one, something a little bit similar, but just a different pattern. And then when you look at the left shoe here, you will notice a herringbone pattern. And then on the medial side of this one, you've got a completely different sort of pattern there. And I think this is what they refer to as the Sashiko style uh, indigo kimono denim, which as far as I understand is inspired by a traditional Japanese repair technique called Boro. So from what I've seen online, each one of these blazers in terms of the swoosh design is completely unique and all of the swooshes, lateral and medial sides are highlighted with this beautiful infrared stitch line uh, which basically runs the entire route around the back of the shoe into the medial side as well. And continuing on with those infrared hits up here in the top eyelet section, you've got this beautiful glossy infrared eyelet. It just like adds that little bit of extra pop of color towards the top of the shoe. And then when you have a look here from the front side, the laces here provided with the shoe are a white set of waxy laces, but with all denim products, the truth is always in the details. It's 
definitely a tagline of theirs that I've seen come up within the Air Max ones and some of their other products. You'll notice here with the aglets of the shoe, these are completely sustainable bamboo aglets and they do have the little scissor logo, unique and iconic to denim brand itself. And then on the opposite aglet, you've got the little Nike swoosh, both being laser etched into those. Now, if you do wanna add some more red onto the shoe, they also provide you with a white and red set of laces over here. I'm pretty sure you had the exact same setup here with the Air Max ones, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, and these just have these glossy metal red aglets on the end, but both with the little micro logos on there too. Now the tongues itself, if I just undo the laces over here, are some of the softest leather, honestly, that I've ever felt. Like, I could probably just sit and feel this, like, for an entire day. It is so, so nice to touch. At the top of that, you've got the Nike swoosh logo, which has been debossed into this new buck suede done in a tan color. And then just again, stitched in with this beautiful infrared stitch. Now swinging around to the heel section of the shoe, that new buck suede in the tan color continues with this sort of heel underlay over here. Again, you do have the Nike swoosh logo debossed into that. It just ties in all of these colors so well together and adds that completely premium feel. And the details don't stop there. Even inside of the shoe, the entire sock liner over here is also done in insanely soft premium leather. You do have some design details over here, which say Denim the Jean Maker. And then probably my absolute favorite part, and if I can get these out, it has to be the insoles. This is something they did on the Air Max One as well. I mean, you guys know me if you do watch sneaker stories, like insoles are a big part of the design for me, and these are just absolutely insane. The leather quality used on the top section over here in this deep sort of beautiful red is insane. And then you've got all of these beautiful jean making tools that have been debossed there in gold, just kind of completing the full picture. And rounding off the collaboration, they do come with this absolutely unique one of one, I guess, custom box. It isn't a box that I've seen on any other collaboration release uh, that I've seen to date. It's basically just got the swoosh that's cut out of the lid part of it. And then inside of the box, it's just completely raw cardboard. But what's incredibly nice with this particular collab is they do provide you with these denim shoe bags. They've got sort of like step and repeat symbols here of all of those uh, jean making tools that you saw on the insoles of the shoe and all together just ties in super nicely with the rest of the pack. Now from a sizing perspective on the Blazer Mid 77s, I would suggest going true to size. Uh, I do have my true to size UK9 over here and they fit me absolutely perfectly. One thing I will say though, if you do have an extremely wide foot or just a wider than usual foot, like you generally do take a half size up in most other releases, then you're probably gonna wanna consider doing that as well as they are reasonably narrow on the width side of things, but the length is absolutely perfect at true to size. And now for the good news that I'm sure many of you have been waiting for, and that is how you can win yourself a pair of these incredible Nike Blazer 77s in collaboration with Denim. Denim South Africa is gonna be running a competition where a couple of you guys, not just one of you, will be able to win a pair of these amazing shoes. And that's all gonna be happening over on the Denim South Africa Instagram page. I'm gonna put a link in the description below which will take you to that competition page. You can follow all the details there to make sure that your entry is legit. And this competition is only gonna be running for a very short space of time. So definitely don't wait to get over to the Denim South Africa page. Put in all your details, follow the instructions, and all the best for you guys there. Keep in mind, this particular release did release globally in around December last year. They are long time sold out. The resale prices of this particular shoe are crazy. They're anywhere between sort of $300 and $500, depending on size. And that's before like shipping and taxes and all of those kind of things we all have to deal with. So realistically, the value of this current pair right now is around six and a half to 10,000 Rand uh, landed cost in this, which is absolutely crazy. So this giveaway is a tremendous opportunity opportunity for a lot of people who might not have been able to get their hands on the shoe before. So a huge shout out to Denim South Africa for A, hooking us up with a pair of these to give you guys the review on and obviously the competition to come. But overall speaking, this is an absolutely classic shoe that's never gonna go out of fashion. It is one of those instant like future classic shoes in my opinion. And I do think just considering the quality of materials provided with the shoe, these are just gonna age amazingly well. But that's pretty much it for this review. All the best for the competition if you guys are entering it. If you did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe right here for more content reviews, unboxings, and giveaways, I guess, down the line. But that's all from me for today, guys. I'll catch you on the next one.